This is Reader Racing RC. Hey, I just was asked about setting your droop screws. I wanted to make a quick video about how to set those. Right now, this is my new, my new uh, Outcast. I want to show you, this is set really bad right now. In order to know what your grub screws should be set at, all the weight and everything from that shaft is being held on with that little tiny nut that's holding onto your piston. So what's happening is anytime this arm goes past this point, it's hitting onto that piston. That's bad news. What you need to do is you need to have this either directly even, so you can just put the pin right back into the shaft, or I prefer just a little bit of pressure down and then putting it in. You just never want to lift it up to put the pin in. If you're lifting it up, you're just wasting your grub screws and you're going to waste out a piston. So what you have to do is have it just nice and tight or above it and then set, set your pin in there. And I'll show you that. I'm going to set your grub screws and I'll show you that how I do that here in just a sec. Okay, I got the truck turned over and you can see where the grub screws are. And you can see that I've already put a washer in both of these. There's one underneath this one and one underneath this one. If you don't have those, if you just screw it out to make your adjustment, you're going to strip out the threads. It's just plastic. So I put a washer or a shim in between it. So now when this screw is all the way in there, there's no way it's going to mash it in any further. So it sits down inside of that cavity. I had to take the guide grinder to one of the washers both the washers and grind off just a smidge so that it would sit down inside this cavity some cars don't do it but I know some of mine like my 6s I've had to put like five or six screws five or six washers in there to make up the difference now now as you can see now with it all sitting down there it's resting it's resting on those grub screws I set this in there it's just almost dead even slips in there real nice or sometimes you may have to push this down or pull your shock up just a little bit to get it to go in. But right now, that's sitting in there dead even, just a little bit of smidge. That is set exactly right. So now when this comes down, it's got the grub screws are going to stop it from going any further. So you're not banging it off the piston. And you less likely to break pistons. I think when people break them, that is exactly why. Anyway, that's my little tip for the day. Thanks for watching.